Hey everyone, today I'm gonna to use a very cool trick that I learned a long time ago, but has saved me a ton of time, and that's using Pay Special to copy a range of data, and then when you paste, it automatically adds or subtracts those cells from a range of data to uh, another targeted range of cells. I have a little example here to kind of show what I'm talking about and illustrate, you know, make it a little bit easier how to understand. So let's say we have this data set and we have these weekly orders that we are expecting for days and nights through a week. All of a sudden we know that there is uh, an order adjustment. You could go in and manually go in and, and add, okay, you know, we're getting 10 more orders on the day of uh, the 25th, the 25 more on the day of the 26th and so on and so forth go through, have to do that 14 times, but there's a much easier way to do that. So all you have to do is select the data that you would want to add the whole range. You're going to hit control C. So, you know, copy and then click on the top left cell where you want to paste the data. You know, you're going to get the pop-up menu. You just go down to, you can hit S or you can click paste special and paste special. The paste special menu is going to pop up and it's going to ask operation. You know, there's some things you can do. You can add, you, su you can subtract. We're going to go ahead and do add. So we just hit add here and watch the data in the top cells uh, in that top range there. You hit OK and all of a sudden those order adjustments, those orders are going to just layer on top of that first set of data, which is super nice and will save a ton of time. I'm going to hit just control Z, undo that. Um, same thing, we're going to we're gonna do pay special again. Let's say, oh, you know what? Those orders weren't actually increases, but rather increase. There was a mistake. So we just go ahead and hit subtract and then watch the top data, data set. It's going to do the exact same thing. It's going to subtract from that. Again, we're going to control Z. Let's say uh, rather than, um, you know, numerical values, we're just going to multiply. Let's say, you know what, we're expecting a 20% increase in orders on the day of the 25th and maybe 50% on the day of the 28th or whatnot. We just have unique values in that range. So we can go ahead and just copy and then we're going to do the same thing, paste special, right click, top left, hit paste special. And then we're going to go ahead and hit multiply and then hit OK. And you'll notice all those cells were just multiplied um, by the corresponding cell that we, we multiply. You can do the same thing with divide. Super easy and it will save you a ton of time. It's just very, very cool pay special uh, trick, which maybe you already knew, but I know it saved me a lot of time in, in the, the past. But anyways, hope, hope this helps. Let me know if there's any other questions about this topic or if there's any other topics that I can uh, help with. And please remember to subscribe to the Excel guy.